Hi guys, uh, I was using uh, ChatGPT. This one is the free version, ChatGPT uh, 3.5. Uh, so uh, let me prompt it. So I'll just try that I want want you to uh, write me Visual Basic Editor VBA uh, code for a PowerPoint presentation. Um, about, uh, let me say, Kenyan history. Kenyan history. <coughs> uh, you are uh, to fill, to fill in, all the text of text uh, in your own knowledge with their own knowledge uh, no placeholders uh, let me say I need uh, I need let me say seven slides then enter. So I'll wait for it. Uh, it's going to write me a VBA code. So uh, let me wait for the code to load. Yeah, that is it. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going, I'm just uh, going to copy I'll copy the code there so my code is copied then after copying the code uh, the second thing I'm going to do I'm just going to uh, follow uh, the procedure number one they say that you you have to open a PowerPoint uh, my PowerPoint is open then after opening the PowerPoint you have to press alt plus f11 key to open the uh, visual basic application editor then I'll press Alt 11, Alt plus F11. So this one will uh, open the uh, Visual Basic Application Editor. So uh, the second step, the other step, you have to go to the Insert a new model, a new module. So in my Visual Basic Application, I'll go to Insert. Then I'll choose Module. Then here I'm going to paste the code that I've just copied from ChatGPT. So I'll paste it there. So another instruction after pasting it, close the VBA editor. Uh, so I'll just follow the steps. I'm going to, after pasting it, I'll just close the Visual Basic editor. Then after closing it, the next thing you have to uh, run the macro, uh, run the macro, create Kenyan history presentation. So uh, I'll go to to run the macro, uh, you can just uh, press Alt Alt key plus F8, Alt F8. So go to your keyboard, uh, you press and hold Alt key, then plus F8 to open the macro. So I'll just click on that topic, then I'll click Run. So I'll wait for it here. It has loaded my presentation. So after this, uh, I can just go to designer so that I can design my slides according to how uh, I want my slides to look like. I can uh, choose my first slide to be like that one. I can uh, choose the design of my second slide. Let me put that on my third slide. Uh, uh, let me select this one. Both. Uh, this one is good. The fifth slide. Can choose two of these. Sixth slide. Uh, uh, let me use this one. And my last slide. So uh, at least you can see now I have a full PowerPoint presentation that was created using ChatGPT. Let me try beginning of the slide.
So you can see this one is my presentation, uh, fully prepared using the uh, chat GPT, the chat GPT 3.5. So uh, guys, that is it. Please like, share, subscribe.